and welcome to my channel. I am Acacia and I am doing a um my new style. Um and as you can see I have a lot of stuff here. Um I have my candles, I have my um saint candles um to help along as you could see here. I have three candles to represent my Orishas. And so, um, we shall begin. So, the f items that I have here are, of course, I have um, birthday candles of different colors. As you can see, I'm bringing some in light. I have red, yellow, um, green, blue. Um, you could also use birthday candles because um, they have a lot of different colors. You can use birthday candles for quick spells and whatnot. So I opened one and um, that I will put back here and I have one green candle as you can see let me turn up my brightness on here there you go so as you can see I have a green candle here um, that would be easy and I also have my St. Jude um, candle as well um, I have a few items. Um, I'll make up, um, the herb version of it and the liquid version of it. And then, um, later I'm going to show you how to use either or, or both. So, let's get started with the items. Again, a green candle. Could be a birthday candle or a seven day candle. Um, I have here rosemary, as you can see. I have my selenite. I use selenite. I have coffee to speed up the process. I have salt to protection. I have chili salt to make it hurry up. Basil. And I will be doing um, a series on... Um, different types of herbs and spices. I have my cups here um, that I'm be using in a little bit. Uh, catnip is in here. I have sage for protection. I have my um, eucalyptus oil. I have a little gold bag that I will be putting my powder in. I have Um, rose petals. I have licorice, Palo Santo, a coffee bag to still work with the coffee idea. Um, I have Devil's Shoestring because that's helped with um, success. Blessing oil or Van Van oil courtesy of my witchy mama, my spiritual mom. Thank you, Star Dancer. This is also courtesy of Star Dancer, Money Herbs that she put together. Um, I have Money Oil, um, courtesy of Echanted Bella, which um, I will put her Etsy shop down below. Um, Success Oil, courtesy of my spiritual mama star dancer um i have cinnamon i have poof by doris uh, morrison poof that will kind of bring extra oomph into it and you don't have to and then all the herbs i show you, you don't have to use all of them um if you use all of them great if not um, you get the general idea. I have mint flakes. And some of these you could also get in your local grocery store. Yeah, or more likely at this point, order it. I have my little mixture of money powder that I made. And that's pretty much it. Oh, and... This is a quick new item that I ordered 
I'm going to share with you this is a new little thing. Um, I ordered some uh, rose nips buds whole. So I will um, use that in one of my magical workings and show you how that's used as well. I have some agamony for protection of my finances. Of course, I have a pen. Um, I have allspice. Banana chips for abundance and offering to my Arisha. I have five finger grass and agamony herbs again, which I probably don't need because I already got some out. I'm gonna put that up. I got some already. Um, I have sassafras earth. I have paper bag to write my petition on when I get ready to do the actual spell. I have two. I have a bottle to put my, um, the liquid version of the money or oil or whatever. I have sea salt, like I said, for protection. Gold glitter for money, represent money. Bay leaf and calamus. So you don't have to use all of these herbs, but this is a good idea. You kind of get an idea. I guess you could say. So let's begin. And I'm back. So I had the other thing set up to make it look less messier. I apologize for the sneeze in the background. But anywho, back to what I was saying. So I got, I'm starting out with the dry version and the liquid ones is just out of, um, reach right now. So we'll be working on a liquid one in a little bit. And first, let's get our dry stuff together. I got my gold pouch, as you can see. And so the first thing I'm going to do is I have some things in um, little shot cups to help. And this is mint. So I have mint, I have some banana chips, so I'm going to add in here for abundance. I have coffee to amplify magic and add a little boost to it. Then I have the the um, surf the saffris root the saffris root. I have my little mixture of powder in here. And I need to be using my spoon. So I'm just going to the spoon. With the gold coin. I'm going to make sure I add the gold coin in here. And just so you know, make sure you have like a little cloth of some type 
when you put your stuff together. Make sure you have that. And then there's some gold sparkles, more gold sparkles in there. Put some sea salt. For protection. So I know which one I've already used. Some basil. I always smell basil. I'm not going to use rose for this. Um, probably use that for another day. Uh, some devil's shoestring. Piece of licorice. Break it. These suckers are hard to break. Of course, you have your power council to bless it when you're done. Um, many herbs. Cinnamon. Um, then you have your um, allspice. Then some catnip for protection and success. the chili salt so it could be both fire under your belt firing your finances to so bring um, your finances fast to you and as well as protection I'm very low on this I'm make my own Some sage.
some um, some rosemary. Agni for agamony for protection. You gotta have a lot of protection when it comes to dealing with money because you don't know where the money is coming from. You wanna protect it so you won't do harm towards, towards you don't do harm. Um, you gotta protect it so it won't get spent so quickly um, and all that good stuff. So it's always good to protect. And five finger grass. So, of course, you will blow your energy into it, blow your inner self, so you know it's just for you, so you can activate it. Careful not to get any of the herbs in your mouth in the process of doing that. So make like a little mojo bag, of course. And then just blow on it. And then... Bless it with this Palo Santo. Oops. Sorry, I'm not a good. Or you could bless it with sage. I prefer Palo Santo. And there you have your mojo bag. So next round, the liquid version of it. Welcome back. Now, I just realized I forgot to add the bay leaf and the calamus fruit, but that's okay. That's gonna um, be into the little liquid and I forgot to mention moon water. Um, this is my, um, the last dark moon of December. 
So that's what this water is. It's the um, new moon water to help banish any, for it to help with new beginnings, to banish all debt and everything that came within my life. So with that being said, um, we're going to add the same things with the addition of the calamus root and the um, bay leaf. And also these other oils, which is the money oil, like I showed you in the beginning. The Van Van for blessings. Um, the Poof for extra kick. The Eucalyptus as well. And the Success Oil. So let's begin. So first I'm going to go ahead and add the herbs in here. I'm going to add the rest of the herbs from the last one. All the ones that's out of the glass, the shot glass. Yeah, I think I got all of them out of the shot glass. Next, I'm going to add the two last roots. I'm going to add the basil. I'm going to add the sage. I'm going to add brown sugar just to sweeten it up a little bit. To sweeten up the gel. Make sure it doesn't cause harm. It doesn't bring harm to those who, um, how harm to those or where the money is going to come from doesn't cause any harm. So I'm going to add that. Add some sweetening gel to it. Sweetening our fruits. Try to anyway. Let's see. So I'm using brown sugar or you can use regular sugar. Whatever you feel comfortable with. I choose brown. Make sure there's no sugar in there because you don't want no ants. Especially with it being raining here. So you can use regular sugar or brown sugar to sweeten up the deal. Make sure I put some baby leaves in there. Rosemary.
Five finger grass. salt again. The other salt with the chili to put fire under the um, protection, but make the money come faster. That's all of them. Make some more. So let's see that there. Are. Um. Of course, the banana chips. Again. That's the rest of it. Oh, okay. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, I am going to add a little bit of whiskey. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, for the simple fact that for me, since my Arishas like whiskey, I use Fireball. Yay, Fireball! Um, for me, um, it's kind of showing my ancestors that I'm serious about this. And it helps as far as bringing more kick to the magic. So I'll add that to it. i make sure I offer that to them when I'm done. I think I added mint. Yeah, I did. I think I did add mint to it. Put that under there. Put that under there. Um, I did add mint to it. Uh, I that. Just trying to minimize as much mess as I have here. Put some coffee in there. Go ahead and take this off. Take the filter off and put the rest of the coffee in here. So I can have some. So I'm gonna do that real quick. And I'll save the filter paper. I'm gonna save that. Try that all the coffeeness. I mean, as much as I can, at least. Coffee. Put that in here. Somewhere. Not here. Okay, so now I'm going to put some of my powder in here. Oh, here's my spoon. I'm looking for it. Silly spoon. And I'm going to be careful and not add the coin in here. Because I don't want it to rust it. But you have the gold glitter to kind of help with the process. Um, of course, you gotta have the alumni for protection. 
I'm going to put the rest of this in here since I have a lot of it. I have some still. Let's just see if we're done. Okay, and now the calamus fruit. I should use the powder, but that's okay. I'll use the root. Oops. And lastly, of course, of the herb before I add in the liquid stuff would be the glitter. Oops. Not too much of it. I got a little bit left. Okay. Now we go for the liquids. Starting off with the fireball. Whiskey. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Bring a little extra zest to it, fire to it. Now for the success oil, like I said, courtesy of um, Star Dancer. Not too much, but just enough. A little bit of the money oil, courtesy of Enchanted Bell Shop on Etsy. Just put a little dab of that. I don't want to put too much. A little less than Van Van oil. You can tell it's been a minute since I used some of this stuff. Poof to add some extra oomph to it. A couple drops in there. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. And you can lift this oil. I love this one, you can this. Oh, I got a hug in there. Oh, there you go. Yep, I'm gonna pull them out. I'm gonna get some more. That's okay. But I have a little bit left in it. So let's move it away. And so far, so good. And now the moon water. I'm going to add a little something else to it. Um, I'm going to add some of my basil water that I made. Some 
bay leaf water as well to emphasize it as well. Yes, it looks a little fuzzy in there, but that's okay. It smells good though. You can use it as a wash. It smells really good. And then I just And just blow your intentions into it. And blow your intentions onto the lid. And then just shake it with intention what you want from it what you like to see happen when you use it you think about the amount you're going to use and then of course you Stage it or polish onto it. So you just polish on to it, just protect it. And there you have it. Your money oil. Your money oil. And so there you have it. You have your money oil. Um, like I said, make sure you have a cloth or something to use when you do your magic. And all that good stuff. Um, and I am going to um, set up for my ritual and just talk to you about my ritual. Because at that time, it's going to be kind of private for me. So, um, I'll just give you a general idea on how to do it. So, until then, bright blessings, namaste, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.